all Ohio red team. Won 29 titles to 33. I'm getting a lot of uh, requests. People asking me uh, what type of racks I use. And uh, here it is. I just bought another one. Perfect home. Let's see. I got the black. See, I've uh, been buying sp been buying a few LeBron 8's I've been laying back in the weeds creeping snag these obviously you guys knew I had those two on the end but yeah but, um, before I get into this I want to give a few shout outs man I haven't done shout outs in a long long time so uh, there's going to be a couple here but uh, you know these are all the people I pretty much you know talk to on a daily or weekly basis about sneakers and shit so these are all my people um, so here it goes that boy 704 DJ Dells TV or the sneaker addict either one um, sneaker guru CDNY 1975 Mr. Crispy Coil Young Dr. Seuss Drick 004 Z-Man Harvey New Jersey for Life New Jersey for Life Shoddy 2-3 Jefferson, OG since 82, Dope Boy Fresh, Bugging Out 23, Chunk Skunk, Chev, Big Sexy for Life, Our Queen or 216, TVID, Sam Colt, Guns Found Deadly, and Sizzle 5, where you at brother? I'm looking for you. I know you hopped out, but shout out to without, without mentioning this man, Jumpman Bostic. Here you go. Dude's a monster in the Jordan game. Really nice guy, the nicest guy you'll ever meet. So if you guys uh, don't know about him, go check him out, man. He's got two pages. He's got um, this, the Jumpman Bostic, and uh, the we'll basement. Start down the here at the end. Um, it's kind of like in reverse order. Um, how I've got these. These are my latest ones. You know, uh, they came out last. I don't know, like last Monday or something. I forget. And they said they were pre-ordering and not shipping till the 22nd. Well, it's 22nd was yesterday, and I got these yesterday. So, um, so no, they shipped them before the 22nd. I don't know what they were talking about, but these are the Unchinas people like to call them, or the Miami Heat home colorway. Um, pretty much exactly like the China, except for it's got a few more hits of red with uh, red shoelaces um, it's got the lion face most of the China's got the um, the China lion face and what's interesting with my pair is I got one of the few pairs that actually didn't have um, the China lion right there so you can see uh, I got the American um, the American China if you will um, yeah so uh, it's pretty cool People were bugging out about this, like not knowing what was going on, because like on the Chinese ones, they got the um, the Chinese kind of pig face looking, whatever it is. And on the back, instead of having the signature, it's got the little Chinese uh, China lion too, or whatever that is. But yeah, here's um, lay down uh, lay down this China and this on China. And one thing I'll say about all these shoes is the quality is ridiculous on every shoe the leather is butter soft um, the attention to detail there's not really um, any defects as in like you know paint drip or you know scuffs or um, anything like that of course the uh, just like the china the unchina has got an icy bottom you guys all know what the bottom looks like so I'm not gonna go into real full detail with every shoe I just wanted to point out the differences between these two because I don't think there's many many reviews of the Unchinas up there. One last look. Both got speckles on the midsole. And pretty much the same exact outsole. Cool, cool. Alright, let's go on to arguably my favorite eight so far. Um, for materials alone, like this is so buttery soft. I'm barely even pressing this and my thumb's sticking in. Um, this is one of the softest pairs of leather I've ever felt in my life and this just feels like leatherly, leathery, leathery goodness. 
just like a leather couch. Like I just want to dive on that thing. Beautiful triple black LeBron. Um, this is the general release. His his uh, player exclusive version has a white Nike swoosh or Nike check. Pretty hot shoe. Um, also, I just seen a picture of those uh, Entourage eights, the version twos. What's your guys' thoughts on those? I kind of like them. Are they releasing them? I doubt it. All right, so yeah, we got the triple blacks, man. I'm telling you guys, don't sleep on this shoe. I'm probably doubling up on this just because this is the softest leather. They definitely used a different leather on this shoe. Um, you know, it pretty much feels the same as all the rest, or it looks the same as all the rest, but the feel is just magnificent. I don't know why it's so soft. It's unbelievable. Then we got the veteran days. I've had these for a little bit. Um, and, uh, you know, I've just been chilling until I got the rest of these. You guys, you guys seen them. There they go. Blue midsole. They could have made the shoe real hot. Imagine red midsole. Red, or just a white midsole. Red air bubble. And all, like this all navy blue upper. That's on the fly wire right here. But like the whole top panel navy blue with a white Nike check and a red outline like this. Whew. Peaches. Or Petrie, sign me up, bro. Let's design some sneakers because I got some ideas, man. I think the world would love it. And then, you know, these next two really don't need any introduction. Got your preheat. And the first colorway. Definitely going to double up on these two. So there you go. It's been a long video. Sorry. Kind of just been rambling. You know, when you don't do a video for a while, you kind of get out of it. You lose your lose your swag. Um, quick little sneak peek before I go here. I'm going to show you guys a quick little something. Um, I'll do it in my cool gray video. I'll explain what it is and who makes the, the product and so forth. But here we go. Just a little quick sneak peek. Boom. I'll talk about that on... Monday, most likely. So, uh, happy holidays. If I don't talk to you guys, Merry Christmas, Happy New Year, all that there. So, uh, appreciate the view, guys, and, uh, you know, be safe out there. Peace.